Hi, Team Seismic friends. I hope you're doing well. Some housekeeping before I talk to you about a new release that we're shipping today. First, we are amazed by how many members join Team Seismic. 50,000 members. You probably notice that we send less emails. We keep it really for important releases or important information. But many members actually want a permanent contact a community, obviously, which is our hub. That's why we launched it. So we have created a site, which is powered by Ning. It's called teamsysmic.com. You can go there and register. It's different than the mailing list. The mailing list will still be used for new releases and major information. But if you want to keep in constant touch with us and also have some you know, things before, uh, you may consider to join it. Having said that, we have a new release today, and we hope to see you in teamsysmic.com. So that new release is um, Seismic Desktop version 0.3, and we removed the preview. Here is what's new. First, many, 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 many improvements, which you will or will not see. Now, for the new features, there is a new posting bar. It shrinks. So one of the feedback that you gave us was that you wanted more tweets per square inches, per, per inches of screen. So now when you're not typing, it will be narrow. When you start typing, it will uh, get wider. And uh, just when you type and when you post the tweet, it comes back so that you can see more tweets. Let us know how you like that. Second, we have been big supporters of multiple accounts. So now you can select from which account you post. So just use the checkbox on the Seismic posting bar, the new one, and you can cross post to Twitter plus Facebook at the same time. But not only, you could also post to two or three Twitter accounts if you wanted to inform different communities you have, plus Facebook if you want. What we have as well is a way to come back very quickly to only one account. So in, instead of checking the boxes, if now you select just the name of the account in the posting bar, it will come back to that account, which is very, very useful. For example, you want to update your friends on Twitter plus Facebook, but then you want to answer to a single account. You just press that account, it will come to that account very quickly. We do not change the accounts in the background for you if you don't want to. Now we'll never change your account, you're always in control. So what we added is a smart replying feature. So let me give you an example. I've received a tweet on my account Loic, and I, I, it's only coming from this account. And I do an at reply. If I have any other setting, you don't want an at reply to go to multiple accounts, and you want it to keep the in reply to, obviously, settings. So if you enable smart uh, reply in the settings, you will immediately see the bar post to that account. Does it make sense? Sounds complicated. You know what? Multi-account support and replies is quite complicated. So if you don't touch it, nothing will happen. If you do, only when you get a tweet, which is from one account, if you reply, retweet, or if you direct message that account, Sysmic will shift back to this account to make your life easier, which I personally love myself. If you don't, that's okay. It will be off by default. Here is another feature that we introduced in uh, Seismic 0.3, it's bit.ly. You can pay past a URL and you get it uh, in a short uh, form so that you can type more text. You need to sign up first over there at bit.ly. You add it to your settings. When you've done that, you get all the clicks. bit.ly gives you lots of stats and we wanted to support it. And that's a really uh, one of the first authenticated services that we support there will be uh, plenty more uh, in the future. There are also some uh, authenticated uh, uh, picture posting services that now you can uh, set from which account. Same, it could get complicated, but for example, Posterous, if you want to force Seismic Desktop to post your pictures to this Twitter account, if you have five set, that's how you do it. I know it's, uh, it's a lot of information, but play with it, you'll see it's very simple, and if you don't need it, well, you just you know, use it the way it is and enjoy all the improvements we've made in this version. We'd like your feedback on this all new bar and multi-account settings, so please just ask Seismic us. Please use teamseismic.com. There is a forum right there. And uh, if you just post on your tweets um, or by email, we will also obviously read that. So we hope you enjoy this version and uh, keep in touch for the final release when we have had all your feedback and obviously a new version coming, coming very, very soon. 
Again, as you could see, we're releasing very, very often. Everything is based on your feedback. Thanks very much, and see you using Seismic Desktop and in teamseismic.com.